Because Pierce, this went down to the wire. Just your defense made one final stand. Yes, sir. Uh, we played really well on defense all, all year. Um, you know, but hats off to Coach Johnson and his crowd. He's done a jam up job with what he's got over there. He calls a heck of an offense. He put us in some sticky situations. Um, fortunately, our kids uh, made a play when it mattered. You know, in the first half, Tyler McManus really had a good half. Just see, uh, how did he control the offense there before halftime? Yes, sir. The, the, the flow of our team really goes through Tyler. You know, uh, he's been a great player for us. He does everything we ask him to on and off the field. Um, we just got to get him to do it for two halves. Okay, and then uh, during Hannah Pamico's drive that got them to their first touchdown, it seemed like personal fouls or targeting or whatever. Yeah, just... well, we, we had a couple targeting penalties, um, you know, and I'm not going to get on my kids too hard about that because, you know, they're running to the ball and putting their hats in there. Um, you know, those were just hustle mistakes. Uh, the, the ones that really got me were the, were the personal fouls, the unsportsmanlike things. Uh, we got to clean that up. Um, but other than that, you know, the, the penalties are what got them there. Okay. Uh, just uh, obviously, you got a chance at a region title now. You guys in Lakeview, just how exciting is that going to be? Well, you know, it's, it's, it's two really historic programs colliding. Uh, Coach King gets a lot out of his guys. Uh, I, I'm looking forward to the challenge. Uh, I didn't look at their score tonight, but, but you know, I, I'm looking to get the best of what they got, and we're hoping to bring the best of what we got. You know, just uh, what are some other factors in tonight's game that you feel were important that maybe the average fan didn't see? You know, I, I feel like Coach Johnson had a good game plan, um, uh, trying to run the ball into certain parts of our defense. Um, and, and I just tried to stay one play ahead. He did a good job checking uh, checking out of plays and in plays, and, and, and we tried to check when he checked and put us in the best position for our kids to be successful. How important was your defense after making the late mistakes to allow that touchdown drive that gave Hannah Pegg was to make a stand there and get get that win. You know, the most important thing about our defense is our kids play hard and they're starting to understand what we do. Um, and, and I think when they play within the scheme, we're as good as anybody on the defensive side of football. Well, Gus Johnson, your team had a chance to win at the end. That's all you can ask for. Absolutely. I mean, but we, we've been saying that our dudes, when it when it matters, got to go win go and make a play. So uh, I thought as a sophomore quarterback, Wade Poston did an unbelievable job leading us down the field there in a two-minute drive uh, with no timeout. So. Uh, I, I'm, I'm extremely proud of him, especially after the turnover in the first half. What kind of problems did McManus present in the first half, and what adjustments did you make at halftime to try to limit him? Well, we definitely knew he could create with his legs, uh, but you know we, we couldn't let him sit back there like a statue and throw it because he's he's unbelievable. He's good. Uh, whoever the if they're not going to take him on the north south team, if they're not going to take him on the south team, they're making mistakes. So he's a dude. Uh, but you know I think we tried to. To keep him contained, I think we did a good job of that in the second half. 